you came across this question in your chemistry exam be it you are preparing to write the jump exam post utme examination or even if you are in your first year in a university so how do you solve those questions this question is actually very easy now let's solve together the question says an alkanoic acid has a molecular mass of 88 they told us that this acid called alkanoic acid its molecular mass is what 88 when i see that i take note of that number it will help us full stop continuation now the question its molecular formula is so they are asking us what is the molecular formula of this compound what is the actual formula of this compound remember when it comes to this aspect of chemistry a compound can exist in two formulas in two different formulas we have the empirical formula and also we have the molecular formula now they are asking us to get the molecular formula remember molecular formula is simply the actual formula of that particular compound whereby empirical formula is simply the simplest form to which that compound can exist so please let's watch as i solve this question because it is extremely very easy so what do we do they are asking us to get the molecular formula they've given us hints already to solve this question why they've given us the molecular mass of the compound which is an alkanoic acid so they're not asking us to get the molecular formula and thank god they gave us option in this particular question and these are the options so the trick to get this answer is simply by calculating the molecular masses of the four options so after calculating the molecular masses of the four options you now check for the one that you get exactly 88 as given in the question are you following me now so the one you get 88 is simply the answer to the question but let us assume that we are not giving options how do we solve it this is where you have to pay attention i'm going to solve it in this format and also solve it in the other format to which we are not giving options let's assume that so let's calculate the molecular masses of the option so for option a option a is simply c4 h9 c o o h let's calculate the molecular mass okay the molecular mass so what do we do here simply now we have three elements here which is carbon hydrogen and oxygen these are the three elements in all of the options okay carbon hydrogen and oxygen atomic mass of carbon i believe you know that it is 12 atomic mass of hydrogen one and atomic mass of oxygen is what 16. so let's calculate together for this is going to be 12 you know when we have a number standing in the front we we'll times that number so it's going to be 12 times 4 and the next thing to do is plus add plus hydrogen which atomic mass is one times what nine plus carbon is what 12 as written there plus oxygen is 16 okay we have two oxygen here so 16 plus 16 okay plus what hydrogen which is one are you following me now so we will not get our answer but let me quickly do for the four options so we just progress whereby for the other one i will not then press all the answers together and just pick the option which is the correct answer so let's do for the option b which is c5 h11 c o o h so it's going to have b something like 12 times 5 on to be fast because i believe you understood how i got this plus 1 times 11 plus carbon is what 12 i believe you know that plus oxygen is what 16 plus 16 because we have two oxygen plus hydrogen one is equal to whereby for option c it is a c3 h5 c o o h so it's going to be something like 12 times 3 plus 1 times 5 plus 12 plus 16 plus 16 plus 1 is equal to okay that's for the third option so let's do for the last option which is option d and it is what c3 h7 c o o h where the molar mass molecular mass is going to be 12 times 3 plus hydrogen 1 times what 7 plus carbon okay plus this oxygen 16 plus 16 plus 1 is equal to 
All right. So you can see we've calculated the, uh, the molecular mass. So let's see our calculator to get the answers for each of them. For the first one, which is 12 times 4 plus 1 times 9 plus 12 plus 16 plus 16 plus 1. That's 102. I got 102. You can see it does not correspond to the molecular mass given to us. So this is out already. I believe you are following me. So let's work for the second option. 12 times 5 plus 1 times 11 plus 12 plus 16 plus 16 plus 1. That's 116. So this one is still out. I believe you are following me. For the option uh, C, it's 12 times 3 plus 1 times 5 plus 12 plus 16 plus 16 plus 1. That's 86. Wow. Almost closed, but it's still out. So let's check for the last option, which is 12 times 3 plus 1 times 7 plus 12 plus 16 plus 16 plus 1. Wow. I have this particular compound's molecular mass to be 88. So you can see that it corresponds to the initial molecular mass given to us in this question. So what would this tell you? This will tell you that this is the molecular formula of this alkanoic acid whose molecular mass is 88. Like I said that if you are given options, just simply calculate the molecular masses of each of them and get one that will give you exactly the same number given to you in the question. That's how to solve it. It's actually very easy. I believe you are following. You can see it's actually very easy. But let us assume that we were not given options to solve this question. How do we not get the answer? It's actually very easy. But now the answer to this question is option D. But let's solve as if we were not given options. So have more understanding about chemistry calculations and solving all of these type of questions. I already have them on the chemistry masterpiece, okay, which is calculations and keynotes in chemistry. So if you are preparing to write the jam exam, this book is very, very important for you. Now, for more information, getting the chemistry masterpiece, do well to direct message me via my WhatsApp number. It will be on the screen.